What's up guys, today I got some pretty cool tools in some metal toolboxes that I think you will enjoy. And we've discussed this company several times on this channel. It's from KTC, which is Kyoto Tool Company. So without any further ado, let's take a look at these cause they are pretty cool. All right guys, like I mentioned in the intro, today we're gonna to be looking at some tool sets by KTC. And yes, you've heard that name before on my channel. It's Kyoto Tool Company out of Japan, and they've been in business since 1950. They are the parent company that makes Nepros, and we all know how awesome Nepros is. Their ratchets and wrenches and sockets are phenomenal, super balanced and super smooth. And Nepros was started in 1995 by Kyoto Tool Company, or commonly known as KTC. What we have here is three different metal boxes that we'll open up and show you, and show you the tool kit that they provide with it that's pretty cool. Um, they offer three different colors, obviously black, silver, and red. And that way you can pick the color that you like best, but they all work the exact same way and have the same tools in them. It's a 56 piece tool kit that has a lot of goodies. This thing is perfect for the trunk of your vehicle or at home or whatever. It's a really cool kit, full metal construction and the tools carry a lifetime warranty. So you may be asking, what's the deal with KTC? Well, Nepros is kind of their top tier line of tools that they have, this highly polished and super fine teeth and all of that. KTC is their average working tool. In Japan, KTC is the number one tool choice by their mechanics and so forth and so on. And Nepros is kind of the top tier line of that, you know, for the guys that kind of enjoy the finer things of life. But the KTC line is the workhorse of their tools. So let's take a look and you guys can check these out. All right guys, you can see these are high quality metal boxes that they offer with this kit. They have rubber bumper covers on each corner to protect the corners from damage. They also have a full metal handle, which is extremely nice and completely full metal latches. So I've got three boxes here. Only one of them contains tools. One of them is a complete set that is full of tools. And I'll show you that in just a second. But I just wanted to have all three colors and that way you can see what they look like. Um, the silver, it looks really good. I don't know if the camera is gonna do it justice, but it's got a little bit of sparkle to it. The black's just kind of a, a gloss black. And of course the red's just a gloss red. So. All right, what's cool about these boxes is it works kind of like a tackle box that you guys have seen. You can simply unlatch them. And when they open up, it brings the trays out with them, which is a really nice feature. Like I say, this is a 56 piece kit. So it covers a lot of different tools that you're gonna need. Obviously on this side, you've got three JIS and standard links, and you have two flatheads and standard links and two of the stubbies, a flat and a JIS. And for those guys that do not know, JIS is Japanese industrial standard. A lot of times the screws are notated with a dot on them. And these is what you're gonna find on a lot of your uh, Hondas, Toyotas, um, four wheelers, stuff like that. And a regular Phillips will fit in it, but it usually cams it out. And that's where the issue comes in. The JIS works extremely well on Phillips, so you kind of avoid all the problems. And when you get these, they all come in a foam tray and the foam trays are removable when you get them and all comes separate, but you could take the foam trays out and put them in a larger toolbox and use this box for something else. But you can see it's really nice. It's a two piece cut foam and it's red underneath. And that way you can see when a tool's missing, but you can organize these however you want. Um, I chose to put my wrenches on the second shelf and that way nothing's covered. 
with the top tray. You can get to it all. As you see, it does have the double box, offset box in. Um, really nice wrenches. They feel good in your hand. Obviously, they're 12 point. Um, it's sort of a matte finish chrome. As you can see, it's not the high polish like we're used to seeing on the knee pros. But the wrench sizes go from an 8 to a 22 in this kit. Um, it does skip a couple of different sizes. Like it's got an 8, 10, uh, 10, 12, 12, 14, a 14, 17, a 17, 19, and a 22, 24, excuse me. So it goes from an 8 to a 24, but it does have some skips and sizes. On the top side, on this side, I chose to put the sockets and it comes with a couple of hex bits and we'll cover those. The sockets are 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, 17, and 19. These are 3 8 drive. As you can see how they look, it is six point sockets. It comes with a ratchet, which is a quick release ratchet. So you do have to push the button to remove a socket or extension or whatever you got on it. You can't just pull it off, which I actually prefer that feature, but it's a pretty fine tooth ratchet. If I had to guess, it's probably about 72 teeth just by listening at it, but it feels really good in your hands. Got a good profile to it. Pretty nice ratchet. Comes with two different extensions, a three inch and probably a seven inch if I had to guess. I haven't measured them. Comes with three different hex sizes. It comes with only three deep sockets and they are six point. It comes with a 10, a 12 and a 14 millimeter, which is pretty common sizes, you know, for a vehicle. But that's what I've got in a top tray and it does come with a little finger ratchet and it does have the place to put it on a ratchet. So that's pretty cool. The second tray down is where I decided to put the wrenches and the Allen keys, the L keys. Uh, the wrench set is a eight to a 17. As you can see, pretty much the same way as the double box in. Of course, these are double open in. Um, it's got the matte chrome in the middle. Pretty nice feeling wrench. Um, I do wish it was a little bit longer, but for a vehicle to get you out of a jam, these will be perfect. So the wrench sizes come from a 8, 10, 10, 12, 11, 13, 12, 14, and a 14, 17. Also in this same compartment, it comes with a set of bits, as you see here. It looks like you get three different sizes of JIS and some more hex bits. It comes with a bit ratchet, which is pretty cool. It is reversible. And it also comes with the ball end L keys. The set folds out. Pretty nice little set here. I do like the length on these. They're really nice and it's that vapor blasted matte satin finish, whatever you want to call it. But the sizes go from a 1.5 up to a 10 millimeter in this. Pretty nice L key set that they give you in this set. And in the very bottom tray, it comes with a pair of the adjustable jaw. We call these regular wire pliers here in the United States. These feel really good in your hands. I really like the grips on them. Uh, the red parts actually got a groove in it and it kind of gives you some extra grip. They feel really good, but it comes with those. It comes with a pair of needle nose, which is really nice. And it comes with a pair of side cutters. All of them's got the same grip on it. It comes with a hard striking surface hammer and a soft blow hammer. This is pretty cool because, you know, one hammer does the work of two. Pretty nice hammer. I mean, a hammer's a hammer at the end of the day, but they pay a lot of times you may need that. And it also comes with an adjustable wrench, as you see here, from a zero to about a 35 millimeter. The 30 is actually there and it extends out a good bit longer. 
So pretty nice adjustable wrench. It's a really nice tool set. I definitely like the way that the box is designed. Um, you can get to everything really easy. And like I say, if you purchase this set and want to pull the foam trays out, you can do that and put them in another box and use this box for anything else you want. But I like the way it's designed. You just simply grab the handles and there you go. Another thing that I really like about this box, if you've ever had a metal toolbox, we've all been there and done that, you forget to latch it and you pick it up and everything goes everywhere. Well, the way this is designed, if you get both of them, it don't matter if you latch it or not, it's not gonna come open. But they did a really nice job designing this box, so that's kind of one of my favorite features of this entire kit. But KTC did send these to me to show you guys, and I think it's pretty cool that they did that. Obviously, I'm a huge fan of the Nepros ratchets and wrenches that I showed on this channel before, and I really like them. They're some awesome quality. And I feel like these will be a great alternative for you guys that's looking to get some really nice, high-quality Japanese tools without spending as much as you do on the Nepros. But these are the three color options you have. They also have a half-inch drive, and I think they have a quarter-inch drive set as well. Um, I'm going to get some details on the pricing and how to purchase these, and I'll share it with you guys, and that way you'll know. Uh, but I do appreciate KTC Tools for sending these. It's really awesome for them to reach out to me and, and share this with you know everybody on this channel. But if you guys are looking for a kit to put in your car, it's a really nice kit. I had a lot of guys kind of hating on the Japanese tools. You know, they, they left some pretty bad comments talking about their junk and this and that. Obviously, these guys have never used a pair of you know, a, a, a set of Japanese tools. Obviously, in any country that tools are made, you're gonna have good ones and you're gonna have bad ones. Um, they were calling the Nepros junk, and obviously those guys, they don't really know what's up. But I don't see anything different with these tools uh, versus the Nepros, other than the finish and the fitment of them as far as the way they're, they're polished out. Uh, Nepros is, is definitely the top of the line. I would put it way over Snap-on as far as quality. Uh, definitely overlooks and the way it feels in your hand. Uh, the Nepros is, is very, very good quality, and this is sort of their workhorse line, so it's not finished as well as, as the Nepros is, obviously. But do not be afraid of these. You know, there's a lot of really good Japanese tool companies, engineer for, for one that makes vampire pliers. They have some very good quality stuff. KTC makes some really good stuff, obviously, as you've seen on this channel with the Nepros line. So I expect nothing less than this from KTC with their own line here. And um, I think it's gonna be some excellent quality tools that's gonna hold up really well over time. All right, guys, so now you see how cool these KTC kits are with the tools in it and how awesome the boxes are and the different color options that they have. The next thing is where can you get them and how much do they cost? First of all, let me say, don't shoot the messenger. I didn't set the prices. I'm just relaying what I was told. But the actual empty cases, if you want a case without the tool kits, they're $399.90. If you want the tool kit with all the tools in it, it's $699.90. KTC is launching a new website where all of this stuff will be available on there. At the time of this recording, it is not live and ready to go, but once it is there, I will pin it at the top of the comments, and that way it will be a direct link to their website. For right now, you can use this email address, contact at kyototoo.co.jp. That will get you in contact with who you need to talk to if you want to purchase one of these kits or the empty cases, as you see here in these three colors. And that's what it is, guys. So hopefully you'll take a look at this. And once that website's up and going, I'll have it linked in the top of the comments. And that way you can take a look at them. Like always, thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to hit the thumbs up and click that subscribe button. It's totally free. It never costs you guys a single dime. Y'all have a great week, and we will catch y'all next time. See ya. See ya.